Hey everybody, welcome to the future site of Adrian C. Nelson High School. We're about two thirds of the way through construction. And what we're gonna do today is just give you a tour of the building. Uh, it's currently Rock Creek Middle School here, um, but starting in the fall of 2021, it'll be Adrian C. Nelson High School. So let's take a look. Hey, as you can see, once you come in through the front uh, entrance here, you've got the main office uh, right behind me here. Over here, you have the classrooms, and you'll see that about 85% of our teaching spaces are in the classroom pod. So you see the first level pod and a second level pod. And then over here to my right, you see another first level pod. And what we're currently constructing right now is the second level pod up, up above. All right, here we are in the new classroom pod location. You can see all the classrooms around the perimeter, just like the other pods that we had. Down here will be the stairwell that'll get you to the first floor. We've got student flex space where students can hang out over here. And just like in the other pods in the center, we got restrooms and other offices and things like that. So you can see here, this is one of the existing pods and you'll notice that there's classrooms that run the perimeter of the pod. And in the center here are special learning centers and bathrooms and storage areas. And each of the pods looks pretty similar to this. And as we come around to the corner here, there's a flex space and teacher workspace um, at the end of each of the pods. With some minor differences in each of the pods, um, they look all pretty much similar, all four pods. So here's the media center. Right now you can see it's still decorated like a middle school media center, um, but this will be uh, converted with decorations for Adrian C. Nelson, um, and this will be our media center. All right, now we're gonna head into some of the construction zones and take a look at some of the new additions to Adrian C. Nelson High School. So here we are in the cafeteria, the commons area. Um, some of the additions that we're putting in here are a student store and a snack shack over here. So here we are in the counseling and career center. Um, we've got the lobby and that'll be the main entrance here with uh, support staff sitting here. And then down here through this hallway here are uh, counselor's office and other support staff offices. All right, so here I am in the reception area of the student support center. Um, in front of me here are offices and as you can see, this is an unfinished space and we're getting ready to lay the flooring here pretty soon. So just outside the cafeteria is a new lobby space. This used to be fields back here, but what you can see uh, behind me over here is the new Fine and uh, Performing Arts Center, the auditorium. And so during the day, this spot can be a spot for teachers and students to come out and eat lunch on nice days. But it also doubles as a spot during intermissions during performances where folks can come out here and mill about in this outdoor area. Just inside the courtyard is the auditorium. Uh, this beautiful space, they're still working on the construction there. They're going to be putting up the sound clouds right now. And there is an uh, audio engineer who's working on the project. Um, each of these sound clouds up here are designed perfectly to give an, an audio experience um, that will highlight any musical or acting performance. Also around the perimeter will be screens with curtains. And the idea here is that it's going to feel like a small space, but it'll sound like a large auditorium, like a concert hall. So when finished, this place will be an absolutely beautiful auditorium. Outside of the auditorium, if we take a, a right over here, we'll head to the rest of the performing arts rooms. Here we are in the lobby, and there's ticketing and concessions over here with public restrooms over here. And just behind me is the Black Box Theater. This is the Black Box Theater. As you can see, the walls are painted black here, um, and in the non-painted areas, those will be acoustic uh, panels. This is meant for smaller, more intimate performances, and beyond that is a scene shop and various changing rooms. 
All right, here we are in the band room. Um, over this direction are various practice rooms and offices, and beyond that is a choral room um, that's very similar to this. You'll notice the, the audio engineer has designed this with the sawtooth walls to enhance the audio in the room. All right, as we exit those rooms and we turn left down here, we head down this uh, hallway. So down this hallway, you've got uh, practice rooms, you've got scene storage, and you've got costume and makeup. Um, all, the, all the rooms to support a performing arts program. Here we are in the new main gym for Adrian Nelson High School. Um, on the right and the left will be some bleachers painted hawk black and silver. Um, and as you can see, they're installing the sound uh, panel, panels right now as we're speaking. And as you can see, it's used as a general construction zone for now. And on the right over there, you can see some of those sound clouds that we talked about earlier being prepped and ready to be installed. And through this exit of the gym, you've got a hallway here with various um, athletic rooms to support the athletics in the school. Just straight in front of us is a weight room, and off to the left here is the wrestling room. So just outside the gym are various practice rooms, storage rooms, locker rooms to support the athletics at Adrian Nelson High School. And as you can see, the beam that was signed at the end of the summer here, um, as the final beam to be installed, is here and exposed in the ceiling in this room. This is the lobby, and when this is finished, it'll be all glass here. It'll be a beautiful entrance to the gym. Um, there is ticketing right here to my right, and then down the hallway will be concessions, and beyond that is where the entrance to the gym will be. Here we are to the entrance for our outdoor athletic facilities. Behind me, you've got the ticket booth. You can see the uh, grandstands over there, and then just uh, beyond the ticketing booth here is the field. Right now they have the, the surface laid uh, for the track, waiting final touches to that. And you can see in the center of that is the football field. It's graded and ready for uh, the turf, which will happen in early spring. Here we are in the baseball softball, softball field sports complex. In front of me over here is the varsity baseball field. And just to the right of that is the varsity softball field. And then behind us here are the practice fields and the JV uh, and freshman softball and baseball fields, as well as soccer. We have concessions here in the booths over here. And then right there is the slab that's been poured for our brand new batting facilities. Hey, thanks everybody for uh, joining us on this tour. Um, of course, all we've seen today is the building, and we know that a school is made up of the people as well as the building. And so in the fall of, of 2021, we'll be welcoming students and staff into the building. And so we can't wait for that to happen so that we have students that are inside the classrooms, teachers teaching. We've got athletics being played on these beautiful fields, and of course, performances happening in the auditorium. So can't wait to see you in the fall of 2021. Go Hawks!